Hi there. Welcome to How to Ace Photography. I'm Joanne. This slideshow is about exposure compensation or the exposure compensation button. When Nikon was designing the camera that I use, they put the exposure compensation button at my fingertips. It's actually the easiest button to reach without moving the camera from my eye or looking for it. I know exactly where it is. And this would indicate to me that the Nikon designers felt that this was an extremely important button. If you're shooting in program mode, aperture priority or shutter speed priority, you are using those particular modes because you want the camera to make the decision as to how much light comes into the camera. You don't want to be stopping and deciding should I add light, should I take away light. You're counting on the camera to do that for you. But sometimes you look at the back of the screen and find that your picture is either too light or too dark. Or you may know from looking at it that the camera will make a different decision than you would make. And instead of going into manual mode and making the decision by yourself, you can use the exposure compensation button. Basically you use your index finger, hold down the button and rotate the wheel with your thumb. And you can add or subtract light very simply just by using those two buttons. You may want to do this because your background is too dark or too bright and it's influencing the camera or your pictures simply are coming out too dark or too light. Anyway, that's it for exposure compensation. Happy shooting.